everyone. Right now, the market basket deadline has come and gone. No deal. But the Boston Globe is reporting ousted CEO Arthur T. DeMoulis has submitted his final offer to the board. News Center 5's Pam Cross reports from the supermarket's headquarters in Tewksbury. Well, you know, I'm just very optimistic and very hopeful that this will all work out in our favor and RDT will be back. As CEO. Kayla Locke is challenging others to stick their necks out. This is week five of the walkout, and the weary workers aren't ready to yield. The, the day that Arthur T walks in the door of that building is the day we're walking behind him. We've been hoping every day for the last five weeks to be going back to work, so that's what we're hoping for today. The deadline for a deal set at 5 p.m. This week, Governor Patrick met with both sides in the feuding family. And though a settlement was said to be close, so far, still no word. An outside company headquarters. No Tickets remain in place, still waiting for the end. I'm hopeful this is it. I really hope this is it. And when Arthur gives us the call and tells us time to go back to work, we're going to put this place back together. And, uh, you know, hopefully it'll be business as usual. And that was Pam Cross reporting.